Hey everyone. Have you ever wondered why so many people in life don't change over time? Well, this is what I want to talk about in this video because it's quite an interesting phenomena. And to put it simply, people don't change over time because it's difficult to actually change. It means that you need to accept that you aren't as great as you wish to be. And then you actually have to put in work to change yourself and to grow and become better. Now, that first part creates a lot of problems for a lot of people because, I mean, even for us who've worked on ourselves, it can be difficult to admit when you aren't where you wish you were, or in some cases where you're straight up just failing in certain aspects of your life, or you can even be creating problems for yourself. So admitting that you're not perfect is something that many people don't want to do. And because of that, they won't change over time. They'll just avoid feeling that way by never having to improve themselves, by never feeling like they need to improve. And this is what so many people do in life because we're just not taught how to take that kind of responsibility for our own shortcomings. That's something that our parents pretty much have to teach us because school certainly doesn't do it and society doesn't do it. So if somebody's parents don't actually instill that in them, they probably aren't going to learn it on their own unless they get really lucky, but most people don't. So since people don't want to accept their shortcomings, except that they're not perfect by any means, they just choose not to change over time. And it's really unfortunate. Now, that other part of it, the fact that you actually have to work on yourself is another roadblock for this because Yet again, if by some miracle, someone is able to get to that place where they acknowledge their shortcomings, now comes a part where they actually have to put in work to become better. And that isn't an easy thing to do because that means creating better habits and not accepting your excuses and your BS and basically just choosing to grow as much as possible. Now, those aren't exactly easy things to implement in your life. I mean, they weren't easy for me when I first started going on this journey, especially admitting that I had a lot of work to do. I mean, I could see it. I remember when I was like 18 or so, I knew exactly the areas of my life that I needed to work on and it was almost daunting to me. It almost prevented me from even beginning because I was thinking, holy crap, I have so much work to do to become the man that I want to be. But thankfully I stuck with it because now I'm quite a bit closer to that ideal image I had for myself. I'm still by no means there, but I'm way closer than I was when I was 18, obviously. I mean, I would hope that that would be the case. But all of that work that I put in, there, there were certainly times where it felt like it wasn't paying off. And so many people give up when they hit those points because, I mean, we know that it isn't exactly the easiest thing to do. So because of the fact so many people just give up, they end up not changing over time. So that's pretty much why people won't change over time and why it's so easy to outgrow people. Because when you outgrow someone, all that pretty much means is you've been working on yourself and they haven't. So at some point you realize, why am I gonna keep this person in my life? Because now I'm heading in this direction and they're going backwards that way. So it's not helpful to surround yourself with people who aren't growing the same way that you are. And that's why quite often we just grow apart from people. So it's unfortunate how this plays out in reality, but it's just a part of life. The vast majority, vast, vast, vast majority of people do not change over time because one, they don't want to accept that they have faults, they don't want to work on them, and two, they don't want to put in the work because it takes a lot of work to improve yourself. We all know that, and it's really unfortunate that these, or at least that mindset isn't taught in school because that's pretty much the main thing that helps people change over time, that helps them grow. They need to have strong mindsets, but it's just, it's not taught anywhere. So yet again, parents kind of have to instill that in their children. And if the parents don't have a good mindset, then how the hell could they possibly teach that to their children? So it's just, there are cycles that end up repeating over time and it's really unfortunate. So anyway, 
I'm making this video way too long because I already explained why people don't change. So I hope you found this video enjoyable. And if so, the easiest way you can support me is just to like, comment, and share, and basically engage with the video so that the algorithm chooses to bless me. <laughs> I will see you guys in the next video. Arrivederci!